All right, everyone, camera number two is in a really nice spot this time so you can see what's coming out of the pipe. People begged me to put it not above the pipe but in front of it. So we have to keep a close eye on it to make sure it doesn't get washed away. That's the reason we usually don't do that. But this is not a situation where I'm going to be away that long. So we're going to start by removing some of it, then we'll pull the grate. No, we can just pull the grate. I don't see a problem with it this time. Look how thick the beaver dam is. Got everything off of it. Once we get current, we can start letting some things just go through. But there's so much debris here, they will clog it up the first day they come back. And this is so disgusting, it smells like I'm shoveling cow poop. It smells just like manure or sewage and it's all over me now, it's disgusting. You just can't help but splash it on yourself. Oh my gosh, this is worse than manure, it smells like dog crap. And there's so much excavator damage making it even easier to clog. You have to push all that slop through. Creating a good undertow. That grate can't even go on properly anymore with all the damage. Well, it's shipped on the camera and all kinds of stuff. All right, it looks like we're in the clear with the camera. Let's clean up a little bit. This will result in about a water loss of about 14, 16 inches. Whoa! This is a nasty one. Very nasty. The beavers probably mix their poop with it. It's raining too. Just about done. Yeah, now you, you see the clear issue. There's so much slop. The beavers will clog this thing up in minutes. Literally. They will literally clog that thing up so fast once they come back here tonight. And this thing is kind of more trouble than it's worth, but it's better than. Finding a blockage in the middle. Pretty good. And the undertow might even block that up a bit too. But by unclogging it, even knowing the beavers are just going to come back and clog it, it's beneficial because we are buying the road time before it washes out. This water you saw how when we arrived was barely trickling out of the pipe. If we drop this thing down about a foot, that'll probably take weeks for this water to get back to this level. And probably a month without a giant rainstorm to wash out the road. Now let's go grab camera number two. It's right down there. We've got a good flow going. Real nice. 